A car crashed into a house in Racine and sent it up into flames. It is a dramatic and dangerous scene here at this problem intersection. Neighbors are fed up. Our Tahalil Mohadeen spoke with neighbors Linda and Joellen, who say they have seen too many cases of reckless driving and are asking city leaders to step in. It's the worst looking house on the block. Yet neighbors aren't surprised to see the wreck. Bound to happen. Other times it just wasn't that bad, but yeah, it's been hit before. An inferno started by a car crashing into this home on South Memorial Drive near 16th Street in Racine Thursday, stripping the siding, littering the sidewalk, and leaving the building charred. It's bad. You see accidents all the time, all the time. People are going just way too fast down this road. Jolyn Rose lives across the street and tells me Thursday wasn't the first time reckless driving damaged the neighborhood. I've been living here for five years and I'd say three, four people have hit that barrier. The White House there, that was maybe a year before this one. Lost control, hit the tree there, bounced off and then hit the porch here. Some neighbors tell me they've seen enough damage to want barriers like this to extend the entire block. Others aren't convinced that'll be enough. Even. If they had cameras, I don't see any cameras around here, just they could monitor. Wisconsin DOT data shows more than two dozen crashes reported in the area since 2021. And neighbors fear Thursday's crash won't be the last. We've called the police and they say that they are shorthanded, that there's nothing they can do. We've called the aldermen. In the meantime, they're taking their own precautions. I can't let my grandkids, we don't let them play in the front yard very often. They do not go down Memorial at all. I'll take the long way down Washington. Some even considering a change of address. In Racine, Tehim Hadin, TMJ4 News.